What is going on, YouTubers? Welcome to another video. So, Sume decided to release their next Dragon Ball Z statue. And they actually went for a movie statue. They did Future Gohan. Now, I'm going to be brutally honest. There are so many Future Gohan statues. Where the frick are my Mystic Gohan statues? I really wish they would have did that. Well, let's check this out. So, it's priced at 665 euro plus shipping, I believe. Uh, so, that is like... 750 bucks and here are the dimensions 54 centimeters tall so it's like what 22 inches so not a huge base very simple base 2000 es <laughs> look at this complete utter lie shipping q1 of 2025 doubt that looks like there is a blinking red light here the base has the logo sort of like, like built into it. The base is different than their traditional design. Complete your wood display. Wait, what? They want you to buy this wooden display thing? Okay, so yeah, that's the light up feature. Just a simple light up. This season one collection will feature seven statues, each from a different movie. Interesting. All right, so, I mean, here is like some photos. So let's just analyze it. I mean, it's obviously Sume detail. Sume is fantastic detail, like their sculpt and paint is excellent, no doubt. You know, kind of thick texture here, not as good as KD if I'm honest. This looks pretty cool, like a little almost fish pond with ripple effect. I like that. But you don't see that unless you're like looking over. The pose is okay. Looks like it's, you know, AC adapter. Portrait, very good, no doubt. You know, I, I like that portrait. It's good. But here's my ultimate problem. In general, with Sume products, they're supposed to be like over the top, elaborate, mind blown. You know, like when they first introduced Sume Vegeta, it blew my freaking mind. The synchronized sound and, you know, light up feature, the incredible texture and detail blew my freaking mind. Then you came out with Broly holding an entire one four scale statue, like a Goku. Mind blown again. Then you have Frieza. Again, mind blown. One of the coolest, like, you know, key blast attack DBZ statues ever made. Love it. Goku, fantastic all around. Very cool. Then you got this. I feel like this is nowhere near the caliber of their previous iterations. You know, I would say Goku was the most disappointing, if I'm honest. But this makes Goku look like a masterpiece. Because this is nothing special. Yes, the sculpt and paint is good. However, conceptually, it's like a 0 out of 10 concept for me. Just not cool at all. And it's still pretty pricey, 750 bucks. I mean, if you look at, I mean, you literally just Google future Gohan 1 4 scale statues. you got a plethora of options. You know, some of these can be, you know, had much cheaper. But, you know, for example, you have the Transcendent Studio 1. Which, I think this, honestly, conceptually looks better. Doing a key blast. Base looks great. You know, obviously this detail is not as good as Sume. But it still does look great. And I know eBay says $750, but you can get this for like $300. It's not expensive. You know, but there are multiple options for future Gohan. So it's just like, yeah, there's so many different customs out there. Now, of course... You know, Sume is, in general, better than most of those in terms of sculpt and detail. However, they are not better than KD, which I do own. KD is way better in every possible way. It was 800 bucks. You get both Androids, a better base, better sub-base. Gohan, uh, which, in my opinion, this Gohan on the KD is just as good as this Sume, if not better. It's a freaking masterpiece. Uh, KD's Gohan. Yeah, like right here, it's actually 200 bucks for Transcendent Studio One. You know, 200 bucks. You know, so 
yeah, on Big Bad Toy Store, it's almost $900. Once you incorporate tax, it will be $900. Spec fiction, well, that's the Goku, but... Yeah, so it's just, it's overpriced. It's nothing special. I think it's a big disappointment, honestly. Sume has incredibly talented, you know, like artists, sculptors, painters, and this is what they came up with. And now they're going to do seven more or six more in addition to Gohan. So it's just like, yeah, I'm just not looking forward to that, especially if they're all going to be like this, just like a single character like this, looks like any other custom out there, just, you know, obviously better sculpt and detail, but it's no better than KD. But if you want a future Gohan, pick up KD. This is not even close to as good, in my opinion. So definitely a huge disappointment, in my opinion. You know, plus the edition size, 2,000. There's no way this is selling out. No freaking way. 2,000? Plus that, that is never going to happen. I mean, Transcendent Studios has had their Gohan for freaking forever. 219 euros 51 centimeters tall so it's slightly bigger only 40 40 i still think theirs looks great like i've seen videos it still looks really good but only 40 and they still haven't sold out in like what four years how soon may expect to sell 2000 i know they have their reputation and you know they're known to sell out, but still, I just don't see this Gohan being a good seller for them. I think they're going to rethink this line when they see this did not sell well. They need to get back to doing, uh, you know, something like Frieza, Broly, Vegeta, Goku. You know, those, in my opinion, are just much, much better. You know, they have... Yeah, how long has it been since Goku? You know, Goku, I believe, is still available for pre-order yet at to cart. 1250 so obviously much more expensive but look how much more elaborate this is you know like i mean obviously i'm not a fan of that i, I wish they'd lower the price and get rid of this or give you a different pose but i love this like this absolutely sick if i had the dbz space 100 percent flankster would be buying this statue but i do not have the dbz space otherwise i would pair this with their frieza you know because i actually really do like this statue i think it's sick this has synchronized sound and light up so it's super cool and the sculpt is amazing big big fan of this goku you know but this gohan that's a huge like you know just like is this the direction they're going these very simple yet still expensive you know dbz statues because that i'm just not digging that but you guys let me know what you think are you guys uh you know happy with it I mean, I just think KD is a thousand times cooler of a statue, in my opinion. You know, plus there's infinitely other future Gohan single statues. Like, frankly, I'd rather spend 200 bucks and get Transcendent than, like, 900 to get Sume, which won't ship for two to three years. Anyways, folks, let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe. Have a great day.